Thank you very much. Please sit. Your Excellency, the Governor of Delta State, Dr. Ifeanyi Ato Okoa, and other members of the Delta State Executive and Security Council present, the Deputy Chief of Staff to the President, Office of the Vice President, Mr. Adekwaye, OFR, members of the National Assembly present, especially Chairman House Committee on Sports and member representing the Abekuta North, Obafemi Wode, and Odega Federal Constituents of the State, the Honorable Olumide Babatunde Shoba. The member representing Ika Federal Constituency Delta State, the Honorable Victor Uwokolo. The Honorable Minister of Youth and Sports Development, Mr. Sunday Dari. The Honorable Minister of Women Affairs and Social Development, Dame Pauline Talon and other members of the Federal Executive Council present. Permanent Secretary, Federal Ministry of Youth and Sports, Alaji Ismaila Abubakar, and other permanent secretaries and heads of federal government agencies and parastatals present. The President, Nigeria Olympic Committee, Abu Ahmed Gumel, members of the organizing committee of the 21st National Sports Festival, all our distinguished athletes, present, honored guests, ladies and gentlemen. Let me first express my delight on this occasion uh, of the flag of ceremony for the movement of the torch for the 21st edition of the National Sports Festival scheduled to hold in Asaba, Delta State, from the 28th of November to December the 10th, 2022. The torch of unity which heralds the festival symbolizes, as we've been told, the peace and unity of Nigeria and is also meant to create awareness of the festival amongst Nigerians and also the world at large. The National Sports Festival is a crucial activity in the sporting life of our country and this is because it is the breeding ground, the uh, engine room for the production of the very many outstanding talents that will go on to become world champions. Some of the great champions uh, who we know today were actually discovered at various national sports festivals, including the likes of Blessing or Kabari, a world medalist in the 200 meters Olympic and World Championships, uh, and also the medalist in long jump for the, at the Olympics. Chioma Junwa, notable for being the first Nigerian to win gold at the 1996 Summer Olympics in Atlanta, and the first black woman to win an Olympic gold in any field event. Of course, we also have uh, Olusoji Fashuba. He was the African record holder and gold medalist in the 100 meters event uh, with a time of 9.85 seconds until uh, Akane Simbini. Uh, beat him, uh, beat that time, with the time in 2021, with a time of uh, 9.84 seconds. Then there is Lucy GK, a gold medalist and world record holder at the Paralympic, Olympic, uh, Paralympic Games from 2000 in Sydney through 2021 in Tokyo. And of course, Nefiok Udo Bong also, the only Nigerian to win two Olympic bronze medals in the four by 400 meters relay, and also uh, silver medals in long jump. And of course, the now legendary uh, Tobia Musha, OOL, the current world uh, and Commonwealth African champion in the 100 meters hurdles. She's also the record holder in these three competitions. So all of these outstanding stars, and there's so many more, all came out of the National Sports Festival. And so we're looking forward to you know, an even more uh, successful haul of great stars at this uh, National Sports Festival. As you notice, they're not all from Delta State, you know, if you notice the names of <laughs> just. <laughs> uh, we are still basking in the euphoria of the outstanding performance of Team Nigeria in the just concluded uh, Commonwealth Games in Birmingham, uh, United Kingdom. The performance of Team Nigeria clearly shows that the progressive agenda 
of the federal government, led by a sports ministry in the sports sector, is yielding the desired results. We are committed to supporting the sports sector to sustain this height, the height that's already been attained. And we realize that uh, the overall goal of using sports as a tool for meaningfully engaging our young people and also for uniting our country is a very sound objective and one that we intend to continue to pursue on a regular and a daily basis. Let me commend uh, the Honorable Minister of Sports, uh, Sunday Dari, very hardworking and uh, dedicated Honorable Minister of Sports, uh, who has done so very well, and we're looking forward to even greater things. I'd like also to congratulate the Governor of Delta State, His Excellency uh, Senator Ophia Yoko, and all the people of Delta State uh, for hosting this festival, the Nigerian version of the Olympic Games, uh, that showcases and nurtures all our potential for the development of uh, sports in Nigeria. And I look forward to going to Delta State uh, myself, maybe either at the opening or, or midway somewhere or the closing. It, we're looking forward to really great um, a really great time at this 21st National Sports Festival. Uh, thank you all very much. So it's now my very special privilege and honor, and I'm sure that that will be in a moment or two.